All right, so this play is a perfect example of why these short corners are the most effective spot, one of the most effective spots on the court. Short corners and high posts. So as we see, Syracuse is in their infamous 3-2. Okay, usually coaches tell players to stand on the block. This is the block right here, but notice where Bancott is. He's not on the block. He's in the short corner. Okay, notice what that does. Can he see this defender? No, he cannot see him. So he has to technically play two. He has to play this zone here, but also see this guy. So let's continue the footage. Ball gets reversed. Look, he has no idea that the big is switching sides of the floor. Look, still, I don't know, this guy needs to be dropping like five seconds ago. Why is he so high and so late? Now he's dropping, but it's too late. Because look, he can guard too. That's that short corner. Now, if he was on the block, he would be able to be in the passing lane. But because he's in the short corner, we call that the dunker position in the NBA because that's usually what happens. Power of the short corner. 